Why men are playing with me? What is wrong with me? What is wrong with men? What is wrong with love? Hello, ladies, and welcome to this new video. My name is Alex Kamant. I'm your French relationship expert. And today I want to talk about why men are playing with you, with your feelings, with your emotions. Why are they trying to fool you? Sometimes they want to be in a relationship. Sometimes they don't want to be in a relationship. Basically, you don't know how to react. You don't know how to change your behavior. You also don't know what to do. Let me tell you something very important. Men are like kids. So if you believe in them, if you give them some attention, if you listen to their words, they will always try to play you They will always try to show you some attention in the meantime to take control of the situation. So I am sorry to tell you this, but you have to know the truth. Men are looking for the control. They are not looking to give you attention, to give you love, to make sure that you will feel happy because they don't care. They only care about themselves. And so you will ask yourself, why men are playing with me? What should I do? What is the solution? And I will tell you something that is very important. It's part of my philosophy. Men will play you because they want to take control of the situation. And also because they will feel that they can play you. They will feel that they will be entitled to lie to you, to tell you that they want to be in a relationship even if they just want to have sex. So I'm not saying it's your fault, but I'm saying that your behavior can change this situation. Hello, Alexia. Hello, Marivic. Hello, Shemu, Dimitriou. Hello, Shamo, Ananda. You're amazing to be here. So let me tell you this, ladies, because I want you to understand this. Men will play with you when they think that they can do it. They will play with you because when they will test you, they will feel that you have a lack of self-confidence. You're scared to lose them. You're scared to be single. You're scared to not be good enough. And this is always linked to your self-confidence. And I coach you. And when I'm on the phone with you, when I'm on Zoom, when I meet you face to face, I can tell you that you're amazing. I can tell you that you have so much value, so much qualities that men will be looking for. But you don't know that they will test you. Because we live in this idea of the fairy tale, love is wonderful, love is easy, love is about giving to each other. In reality, men will test your boundaries. And if you cannot affirm yourself, if you cannot show that you deserve more, that he needs to respect you more, what will happen? Guy will take you for granted. And guy will never give you the attention that you deserve. Okay. Hello, Erika from Finland. Tell me in the chat, where do you come from? But also, is it a situation that you have experienced? You start to date, you start a relationship with a guy, and you don't realize that he's testing your boundaries. And he will create a sense of scarce. So basically, you will be scared to lose him. You will be scared to not be good enough. And you will start losing some self-confidence. If it's your case, ladies, you have to understand that it's possible to reverse the situation. What do I mean by reverse the situation? Whether you are in Dubai like Julie, whether you are in Pakistan like Umi, or Dimitri that is in Greece, you need to stop thinking, what can I do for him? How can I get this guy? How can I make him commit? No. You need to tell yourself, I want to receive. I will make sure that this guy will give me the attention that I deserve. This guy will give me the love, the excitement, the emotions that I deserve. We will just reprogramming your brain. And at this moment, you will feel stronger. Also, ladies, I want to tell you that today is the last day for the discount on the launch of my project, my new product, How to Be Confident, right? So if you want to click in the link in the chat, right? Click in the chat. You will find the link for the special discount price because it's the launch of my new product, 
how to be confident, how to make sure that you will have your boundaries, you will love yourself, and you will be able to show to this guy that he has to fight for you. Ladies, I'm sorry to tell you this straightforward, but I have to. A man will play with you because he thinks he can do it, because he doesn't care about your feelings. He knows that you're so scared to lose him that you will do whatever he wants you to do. And of course, we can change this, right? Of course, we can fight for this. Of course, we can reverse the situation. But in order to do that, you need to learn about just challenging this guy and reprogramming your brain. Tell yourself one thing here. When a man is playing with you, it's because in his mind, he's not serious. Doesn't want to commit to a relationship, doesn't really want to provide you happiness, to help you, to assist you, to attract you, to seduce you. And so that's why we need to tell ourselves, men will play when they know what I want. So that doesn't mean that you have to play a game and hide your feelings, but you need to always make sure that this guy will meet your needs and goals. The exercise that I want us to do today is very simple. You take your phone or you take just a paper and a pen and you go on notes and you will write down, what do you want to receive from a man? Listen to that, ladies. What do I want to receive? And you need to be specific because sometimes you will say, I want to receive love. What is it exactly? If you can go into details, you will reprogram your brain and it will be focused only on this. So there is Marilyn asking a question in the chat. Alex, why does he ignore my messages for the full day? Marilyn, he will ignore your messages because he knows he can do it. Because he knows that even if he ignores your messages, you will still be there. And so the best way to react when a man is playing you is to be distant. Just do the same with him. Just show him that you can also be distant and you will not communicate with him. We don't do it in a bad way or playing games. It's all about coming back as a challenge. It's all about showing this guy that if he doesn't want to give you interest, you will not give him attention. And I know that sounds scared for you. I know that you will be scared to do this. But ladies, I can guarantee you that when you reprogram your mind, when you just focus on my new product, Confidence Now, you will be able to act differently with a man. And you become a challenge like Doma, Donna Marie is saying in the chat. And that is exactly what we want. We want to come back as a challenge so the guy will be able to see what he's losing here. He will be able also to value you. And remember, that's how you build the connection. So please, make sure that you will smash the like button. Subscribe to the YouTube channel if you have not done it before. And tell yourself, I can reprogram my mind. I can be a challenge. And if a guy is not giving me his attention, he will not receive mine. No, there is no way that he will receive your attention if he is not here for you. Okay? There is Ananda saying, you need to do the mirror technique, Marilyn. If it doesn't show interest, you don't either. Because that's how you show a man that he has to fight more and more for you. That's how you show a man that he needs to provide you for like more attention, basically, you know? So that's what we need to do together. And that's it. That's it, ladies. Okay? Hello, Leslie. Hello, Fumza. Hello, Camilla. Suzanne also. So Suzanne is asking Alex, what if he's traveling for business and he tells you he won't be able to speak to you? So I don't know why, but I don't believe when someone cannot do something like this, you know. Even if you travel for business, you can have time for the people you love. Even if it's just a text message, a picture, a phone call for two minutes, right? So when he said that he won't be able, you can just say, you know what? I know it. I know it's very important for you. Let's just take two minutes every day so we can just stay connected. Ask for less. But if he says, no, I'm too busy. If he sends like some bullshit, 
you need to be distant. And you need, when I say distant, you need to also reinforce your personal life. What will, we, what will you do during the time that you're not with this guy? Because you have a tendency to not be distant, ask questions, be codependent, and chase him. And so why will I change if I know that you will always be there? Whatever I do, you will always be there. Why do I have to change my behavior? I don't. I have the control on the situation. Okay? And so, ladies, if I'm doing these lives and these videos, it's because I want to teach you that it's possible to be happy. I know how heartbreaking it is when you love someone that tells you, I cannot talk to you, that don't respond to your text message. Read your text message, don't respond to it. That is not okay. But that doesn't mean that it's over. It's just the beginning, and we can change it together. That's why we do coaching with Coach Andres, my head coach, amazing coach. You can come and visit my website, FrenchRelationshipExpert.com. You have tons of articles, and I explain to you what you need to do. I explain to you that today it's time to change, okay? So I know it's not easy. Thank you, Emily, for saying that this is very interesting because it's possible for us today to reverse the situation, right? And we will be able to do it together. So ladies, please, it's the last day for the special discount. If you want to be confident, if you want to make sure that a man will love you for who you are, not what you give, come and get my product, Confidence Now. I've attached the link in the chat, okay? Marilyn saying, like, Alex, should I ask him question? Never. Every time you ask a question, it's attention and interest that you're giving to a man. That's how we take control of the situation. Because we will never respond to, to your question. We will never tell you the truth. You will always be focused on us. And then we have the control. Ladies, this is over. Today it's over. No one can play with you. Because you know how to be distant because you can reinforce your personal life, because you can be happy, and you know that, ladies. Okay? So I will see you not next Tuesday, but next Thursday. So I will move the live from Tuesday 2 p.m. to Thursday 4 p.m. Okay? Every Thursday, not this one, the next one. Okay? I will be with you, and I will be able to answer your question, and I will be able to give you some hope, character, energy, and tell yourself, Okay, I can do it. I'm able to reprogram my mind and challenge this guy so he will never play me again. Okay, ladies, make sure that you will do it. Make sure that you will be confident. And of course, start focusing on you, your need, your wish, your goals. That's it. Okay? Like Shimri saying, we need more live and more likes. So make sure that you will destroy the like button and subscribe to the YouTube channel, okay? I see you soon, ladies. Take care of yourself. Have a really nice day. Bye-bye.